Hi guys, how is it going? How is your day going? Are you ready to train? We've got a full body workout coming up. So this is absolutely live and real time. So all I need you to do is get your vest ready. If you don't have a vest yet, why not? They're amazing. They are going to push you so much harder. What they do is they add resistance to your workout. So effectively making you heavier, which means every time you do something, you're pushing more weight. They're dead easy, dead comfortable. So if you do still want one, if you are looking at them every time we train and you think, yeah, I want one of them. All you need to do is click the link up of this video. We're not just going to send you one. We're going to send you two. So you can give one to your best friend, your relatives, your loved one and help them get in the best shape of their life. Honestly, you will never regret getting a vest. They're amazing. So today's workout is full body. It's 50 seconds on with a 10 second rest. Now there are two options for you to do today. You can either do skipping as cardio as the interim. So that's what you'll start on. Or you can do squat and press. So you can get some weight and you can do a squat and a press. So depending on how you're feeling today, sometimes you have strong days, sometimes you're just cardioed out. If you fancy a bit more cardio in your workout today, which is what I'll be doing, get your skipping on. If you wanna go strength, you're gonna do a squat and press and that's what you're gonna replace instead of my skipping. Okay, so you've got, basically, if you wanted to do this workout twice, you can do it with skipping all the way through and then with a uh, squat and press all the way through. So if you wanna do that, Awesome job. <laughs> Good luck with that. Um, are you ready to train? Are you ready to work out? Yeah? Awesome job. So, um, 50 seconds on with a 10 second rest. You're going to start with skipping or squat and press. I'm going to start with the next exercise, which is what you'll be doing. Okay? How do you feel about that? Good. I'm very glad. So, say hi to me. Let me know where you're from. Let me know what you're doing. Let me know if you're joining in. Let me know if you do this workout. If you do, make sure that you like or tag us so we can share you. Are you ready? Yes. So, skipping or squat and press is what you're going to start on. You're going to start in 10 seconds. Starting from now. So, you're going to start with skipping or squat and press and then you're going to do this next move, okay? Awesome job. Are you ready? Let's go. So, you're going to jump in and out. So in and out jumps, this is your next move after whichever one you just picked. So we're warming up the legs, warming up the core. Come on, push. 33. Now you might be tired, you might have done legs today. You just gotta get warmed up the first couple. Always horrible. But then you're gonna smash through it, I promise. 20 seconds. 17. 13, I'm going to work all your body today, 9, 8, 7, 5, 2, last one. So, you're doing in and out jumps, I'm now going to do skipping, that's how this works, okay? Working real time, training together, you're my gym partner, I'm your gym partner, and that's how this works. 3, 2, 1, let's go body rockers. So, Make sure your head's high, you're pulling your abs in. You squat down really low. Push. It's full body today. I know a lot of you love skipping. But I've given you a strength alternative if you need one. If I sound a bit gravelly, it's because I've just come off the back end of the cold. <laughs> so breathing is going to be... Seriously hardcore for me today. I'm gonna sweat it out with you. Seven, six, five, three, two. Whoo! Know about that one? So you want to skip it or squat and press? Whichever one you prefer to do. And then you're gonna do what I'm gonna do. Okay? Hopefully you can see me. So you're gonna do one push up. One spider, come round, get down. So one leg push up, same leg, spider. If you can't do this, you just do whichever one you can do. One leg push up, one spider, turn it round. One leg push up, one spider, turn it round. The same leg, the same 
same leg is going to be your single leg and your spider leg, okay? Let's go. If you can't do that, just do whichever push up variation is right for you. Let's go. Come on, push. You've got this. 30. On skipping. Are you ready? <clears throat> so I apologize if you're doing squat and press because this one is going to be very similar but for those of you that are skipping you're going to want to do this one clean and press, squat and press. So flat back, clean, press, squat down, press up, full body move, clean, press, squat down, press up, push, come on, so your head's high, you're looking at me, your back's flat, your abs are in, squat down, press up, down, come on, 10, come on, 4, 3, 2, last one, so, Clean and press, squat and presses for you. Make sure that your back is flat. Make sure your head's high. Keep good form. All the time, good form. Let's go. Come on. Clean and press, squat and press. You're starting to get warm now. You know about it when you've got a cold. Getting back into here. Shocks the system, that's for sure. 30 seconds. Come on, push. 20. Clean and press, squat and press is for you. Look at me, make sure your back's flat. Squat right back. 10. Okay, so skipping is for you. Stay focused, stay in the game, keep working hard. Swings are next. So you can either do double swings like I'm going to because I've only got my dumbbells. So I'm gonna do double swings. You can do single if you wish, but I wanna make sure that I'm pushing myself to my max weight. And both of these equals my sandbag. No point doing half-hearted, push yourself, so you can do it single if you wish, but if you've got a weight that's heavy enough, make sure, but if not, get them double going, it's all in the hips, come on, 10, 5, weights is my sandbag weight so that's why I use two of them don't just use a weight just because it's light get on it push yourself don't go through the motions push yourself through every single rep 37 come on people let's go get them swings in use your hips drive forward squeeze the ass 25, 20, you're doing awesome, 14, come on a couple more, squeeze it, hello everyone, 4, 3, 2, time, so you're on skipping, that's yours. 
<clears throat> you're skipping or you can do elevated triceps now you can do them like me you can do them like this off the back you can do them like this pushing forward on something or advanced people let's get working don't be afraid to push yourself don't be afraid to try new things making me sweat 20 starting to sweat, starting to get good, stay with it, stay focused, come on, let's go, triceps, I don't care how you do them, but get them done, come on, yes sir, we're working now, we're starting to sweat, 30, know that um, high knees is the, the most calorie burning exercise you can do when I did it on my polar so that's why so let's go this time look at the chest can you see me yes so you're doing skipping and then you're on cross push-ups now you can elevate like me or you can do it on the floor in a box working chest Taking all your weight from one side to the other. If you're not sweating right now, I don't know what to tell you. Push. Come on. Sweat is pouring off me. Stay focused. Stay in the work. Let's go. Get them push ups in. Get that chest in. Gotta do every single muscle. Gotta work everything. I don't care if you're on your feet. I don't care if you're on your knees. I don't care if you're push up in, off a board, up against a wall. However, you're doing it, just get it in. I don't care if. You're a super beginner and instead of skipping you're just marching. Just keep going. You've got to want it. 15. Come on. 10. 5. 2. Last one. So, next one, legs, one of our favourites. One leg only, you're skipping. Now, if you can, put your weights above, lunge, press, come up with the knee, lunge, come up, lunge. Now, if you can't do the press, just hold the weights here and try and work on your balance. But try to get them weights above your head. Work on your balance. Twenty seconds wobbling. I've got seven and a half kilograms in my hands and a six pound vest. If you want to know, and I'm wobbling. I'm trying to keep looking at the timer and looking at me and talking. It's not cool. It's not easy. Are you ready? 
lunges for you. Let's do it. That lunge is for you. You ready? Let's go. Try. Pull your core in. Work that balance. Then you do the other leg next. Come on, push. I start the next one, next leg. Stay focused, stay with it. Go hard. Don't just go through the motions, go as hard as you can. So this time, lunge back, press, come up. Now you're gonna be better on one side than you are the other, but that's perfectly natural. Again, I'm trying to look at everything. Just need to concentrate on what I'm doing. Down. I keep wobbling today. Some days, it's just harder than others. At least you know I'm human, right? We all wobble, we all have off days. Doesn't help that I'm in the wrong trainers. 10. Come on, keep skipping. Three, two. Oh, wobbled a lot on that one. This side of my body was not happy. Ooh. I'm doing all right. I said a cold two days ago. Let's go. I'm not gonna beat myself up about a bit of a wobble. Internally I am. I'm like, please. Come on, 30. Come on, push. Get that lunge done. Nineteen. I'm right with you. Ten. Come on. Three, two. Oh. How are you doing? You're on skipping. Okay. You ready? Tell you, it's hard to breathe when you're so cold. So, your next one, we'll do it. Surfers, come in, touch your feet together, switch around. So, stay nice and low. Get a nice rhythm. Push 30 seconds. Come on, skip. Go down into that plank, pull your abs in, then pull your abs in to bring your knees in, head is high, jump up, touch your toes, again, head is high, turn round. Oh, I'm feeling it now, I'm not gonna lie to you. It's getting tough now. Stay focused. Let's go. If you're like me and you had a bit of a cold, listen to your body. Just go as hard as you can. But listen to your body. Take deep breaths. Take an extra sip of water if you need one. 30 seconds. Come on. Get them surfers in. You're doing awesome. 15. 10. 5. 3, 2, last one. 
Awesome job. Are you with me? Stay focused, stay with it. Come on, this is your workout today. You're almost 20 minutes in. So you're gonna do one halfway up knee. Come up, up right row, change sides. Up. So, if you wanna do it in the middle, you can. It's a bit easier. But make sure that you've got a weight that's pushing you. Maybe your sandbag. 24. Come on, skip. 17. 14. 10. 5. 2. You're doing so good. You're so good. Stay in it. Half burpee. All right, row for you. I know you've got this. I know you've got it. Keep pushing. Yeah. Working everything. I'm not going to miss anything today. 30. Come on, let's push. Keep going. 18. 12. Yes. Come on, a couple more. Seven. Three. Two. Remember, if the skipping's getting too much for you, you can always go to strength, which is squat and press. You don't even need to add the press if you just want to do squats. You can do that as well. Oh, are you ready? So, one front, one side, working shoulders. So we just did a bit of shoulder work with that upright row to get them warm. Now I'm gonna work the shoulders so you're not gonna come any higher than your shoulders. So like bending the elbows, pull up, take it down. Down, come on, 30. Come on, you've got this. You're so close. Down. 18. I'm sweating so much. 15. 10. Eight. Come on, skip for me. Or do your squats for me. Four, three, two, last one. Okay, so you come up. One side out and slight bend in the elbow, but really working them shoulders, okay? Concentrate on the squeeze, hold it for a second. Not speed, control. Shoulders. Come on. Come on, push, push, push. 37. 32. Come on, squeeze. Work them beautiful shoulders. 25. 18. Ooh. Working today. 12 seconds. 7, 6, 3, four. That's one. Make sure you're taking lots of water. I know I need it today. Whew. Okay, so this time, again, arms and back. You're gonna do skipping. You're gonna do a bent over row and then a kick back. Take it down. So come back, kick it back, take it down. So you need a weight that you can happily row and then kick back, keeping your elbows higher than your waist and holding it for a second. It's all about the squeeze. 24, wish you could see how much I was sweating. 21, skip. You pull your abs in. Now remember, you're working your back, you've got your vest on. So that bend, you're working against the resistance of the vest. You've got to squeeze at the top for me. Squeeze. Five, three, two, oh. 
I really need you to concentrate. When you come back, squeeze, really squeeze those triceps at the back. That's where I want to see it, okay? All right, Liz. Oh, I just wipe my face. Keep going. Let's go. You're doing awesome. Stay focused. Come on, squeeze that tricep. Really concentrate, mind to muscle. That's what I need from you, 20 seconds. 18. 10 seconds. Four, three, two, last one. Okay, your next one you can stay with a heavier bent over row, like the one we just did. So again, working back. Hey, okay, I'm always thinking everything has a purpose. Or you can use your challenger bars and do your pull ups using your challenger bars. It's entirely up to you. So, whichever one you want to do. Can you see me? I hope you can. i move back a bit. Can you see me now? So, whichever one you want to do, that's what I want you to pick. You can do bent over row. You should be skipping there right now. You should be a little bit out of breath by now. You're almost hitting the 25 minute mark. That's serious. Full body. Push. Everything is a lot harder when you've been poorly. That's for sure. Your body feels so tired. I'm plowing through there with you. Yes, I'm not quitting. I'm not quitting. I'm right here with you. So you're on either bent over row, which is just the one we just did. So this one, with some heavier weights than what you just did with the triceps. So really go heavy and squeeze into the shoulder blades. Or you can do your reverse pull-ups using your challenger bars. 35. 30. Come on, so close. Promise. 23. 19. 12, 11, 10. Four, three, two, last one. So, do some abs next. So stay with it, stay, stay in it. So you can either do them on the floor, you're skipping, or you can do them off your um, challenger bars. It's entirely up to you, whichever one you want to pick. I prefer to do them off your challenger bars, obviously, but if you can't, do them off the floor. Just do a crunch, or pick any ab exercise that you really like. Come on, push. Let's go. 24. Come on, get skipping. You're doing so well. Use your legs. Nearly there, a couple more. Time. So. Those are for you. That's your last move before we head on to the bonus. So make sure you really work at pulling those abs in. Pull them abs up, okay? Let's go. Forty-two. Come on. Thirty-one. Oh, you've got this. Push, push, push. 23. 20. 15 seconds, come on. Pull them abs in. Fully pull them in. 10, 9. 4, 3, 2, that's 1. 
Okay, take a sip of water. Take a sip of water. We'll do a bonus. Whew. So what we worked there, we've worked back with the row. We've worked shoulders, worked abs, we've worked legs. Basically worked everything. It's full body today. Nice, with the skipping involved as well. You've got a bit of cardio, so maybe you've added this onto the end of your workout today. Or maybe this is just your workout today. Whatever you did, do the chest obviously. Whatever you did and how you did it, let me know. I want to know. So. Are you ready? So. It's a full body burnout. I know. So it's, all we're gonna do is do uh, two, four. So you got another about 12 minutes. I know. But no skipping, okay? So there's no skipping involved in this one. So, it's a full body burnout. We're gonna burn out each bit of the body that we've already worked and add a bit in as well. Are you ready? So, you're gonna start, this, you're gonna start with, uh, what should I get you to start with? Let's start with jumping jacks, okay? You can start with jumping jacks. Then I'll finish on jumping jacks for a change. We don't do many jumping jacks. You can have a round of skipping if you prefer, if you wanna add another round of skipping, but we've just done 27 minutes. So, are you ready? This is your bonus, so don't even think about going anywhere. It's different, this bonus, it's full body. We're just gonna take out the cardio, so we're just gonna do strength. So, are you ready? Your first round, if you don't have the challenger bars, you're either going to pick push-ups or tricep dips. One of the two, okay? So that's all you need to do. So just pick one of the two, but you're going to start with jumping jacks. You've got 10 seconds. I can't stop sweating. So it's all strength. <clears throat> so if you don't have these, you're either going to do push-ups or you're going to do a tricep dip, whichever one you want to do. Push. It's all about strength for the last couple of rounds. Can you hear my trainers? Slipping on my sweat. 29. Come on. Push. Yes, sir. You're on it. This is your bonus. This is where we burn it out. 14. 10. Tricep should be on fire. Seven. Four. Three. Two. Last one. So you're on either, if you don't have those bars, pick a push up or a tricep, whichever one you want to do. That's yours. Okay. I'm doing the next one. Next one. Back to the reverse pull ups. So again, if you don't have the bars, you can do bent over row. Are you ready? I don't know if you can see me, I'm hoping you can, but I'm not sure because I can't see you. But I'm hoping you can. Up and down, work in the back. Let's go. You're on those push-ups or triceps, or both like me. If you've got your challenger bars, let's burn it out, people. This is all about getting a little bit of speed in, burning out the muscles. Try and go as fast as you can with good form. Get some pace in it. I'm trying my best. Ah, my arms are burning. Push. Ah, arms are on fire. Okay, so you're on those ones, or you can do a bent over row. It's entirely up to you. Next one, flies straight up, back straight up. So it's a medium weight, very actually, Quite a light weight. It's all about the squeeze back. Bring it up. Squeeze back. Oh, wow. We are burning this. Uh, come on. Uh, 23. 21. Oh, shoulders are on fire. 12. 10, 3, 2, okay, so we've done back, we've done shoulders, let's do bicep, let's 
Do them biceps. You're on those flies. Then you're on biceps. So single, single, then a double. 70% of the way up, double. Take it down, single. Don't swing, single. Double, double. Single, single, double. Come on, stay with that back work. If you need to take a minute, just stand up. Double, double, single, 14, single, double. If you're pushing yourself with max weight like me, you shouldn't be able to go dead fast. You should not be doing this. It shouldn't be like that. If you're doing that, then your weight is way too light. So, let's go. Let's work them shoulders. Single, single, you're on, tri you're on biceps, double, double. So, single, single, double. Double. Uh, don't let your body swing. Don't let your body swing. Use your core. Double. Double. Come on. Sing up. This is the burnout. This is the burnout. Double. And if you've got a decent weight like me, by the time you get to your last 10 seconds, you are on fire. Eight. Oh. oh, that's one. Oh. Okay, so shoulders are for you. I know. I apologise in advance. So let's do some obliques. So up you come. Whew. Up to the side. Now, if you don't have challenger bars, you can either hold them to two chairs maybe. I know some people use like walkers and all sorts. That's in my frames. Or... Just get on the floor and get some abs in after you've done those shoulders. Let's work those obliques. Come on. Lift to the side. Lift. Come on. Come on. 15. 10. Arms are on fire. Are yours? Six. Four. Two. I'm knowing about this one. So, let's get some inner thighs done. So get down. And I'm gonna use both weights. You can either hold the weights. I need you to be able to see my legs. You can either hold the weights in between your legs like this, or if you've got double weight, you can put them like this. So you're gonna plie squat down, toes pointed out. Two, hold down for two. Come up for two. Hold down for two. Come up for two, squeeze. Hold down for two. Come up for two. Your weight's in the heels, your head's high, and you squeeze. Lift. Hold down for two. Lift, wow. Hold down for two. Come on. Get them obliques in. I know, I know. We've got this though. This is your burnout. This is the end. This is where it's all going to be awesome. Stay with it. Stay focused. You've totally got this. So, it's your last round. Get them in thighs done. I'm going to do jumping jacks. I'll take off my vest. So sweaty. Come on, let's go. 34, 30. It's your last one. Get them plies in. 22. Come on, squat down. Really squat back. Abs in, squeeze your inner thighs. 10. Eight minute bonus. 
and then a 30 minute workout, so that's another 40 minute workout you've got there. <sighs> Full body. <sighs> that was really tough for me today because I've just come off, off a cold. So breathing wasn't particularly easy, but we did it, we managed it. You gotta just listen to your body. Push yourself as hard as you can. And I really need you to make sure that A, you're lifting a decent amount of weight. B, you're pushing yourself really hard through every single move, which means if you're finding it easy to get to the 50 seconds on your knees, when you're doing push-ups, you need to start elevating for the first 10 seconds and then go back down to your knees. You need to start pushing yourself. If you're not seeing results, A, check your diet, and B, push yourself. Get a vest, add some resistance, add some more weight. These are not easy workouts if you're going to your max. <sighs> High five, everyone. Let me know if you did this. Let me know what you wanna see um, next time. Just pop it below here. Any questions, we'll answer it, so just pop it below here. High five, everybody. Let me know what you thought of today's workout. It's nice, a little good rounded workout today, which is what I wanted, just to get back into the swing of it. Um, I had an awesome time. High five, everyone. Bye.